Hi guys, how are y'all doing? This is Tanya from Flores Party Papers. I wanted to show y'all how to save an image from google.com, upload it to your Cricut Design Space, save it, and then modify it, open it up, print it, and cut it. So, I'm going to find an image for you. So, let's type in elephant. Elephant clip art. So there we go, elephant clip art. It's taking a little longer, sorry. Do 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 do. What is the deal? Okay, let's see. I'm going to click on images. And uh, I'm going to go down. And let's say I'm going to pick this one right here and I'm going to right click. I'm going to save image as. And I'm just going to go ahead and save it into the ping file under the clip art. Okay, then I'm going to go to my Cricut design space. I'm going to go back. Let me fix my thing here because it's kind of in the way. Okay. So you can see all of the files that I've already saved from Google. Some of these right here were uh, made myself or I bought. These on the top here and here were ones that I had saved from Google. Okay, guys. So you're going to go to Upload Image. You're going to go to Browse. And you are going to find the file that you just saved from Google. So you're going to go over here. You're going to go down. Okay, there's the elephant right here. So I'm going to click it. I'm going to open it up in my files. And as you can see, the screen is already around it. That's going to take away the white or any other background. Uh, but if it's not like that, you're going to go to Moderately Complex Image. Then you're going to go to Continue. Okay. Then you would click up here where it is the select, select and erase, and you would click here, you would click here, you click here, you click here, here, and you're gonna take you would take away all of this white. There's normally white around the background, so that would leave just the elephant. Okay, so that's finished. Then you're gonna click, click continue again, and uh, you're either gonna save it as a print file or you're going to save it as a cut image. Well, I am going to save it as a print then cut image, okay? So then I'm going to go over here and I'm going to click save. And once again, it's taken forever. So I'm going to go here and I'm going to open up the file that I just saved. I'm going to go here and I'm going to insert image. And of course, I already have some things opened here. Let's see. Let me open up a. Let me make a new one. And then I'm going to cancel this project. So I'm going to go to upload image. I'm going to go to my elephant. I'm going to go to insert images. Where's my elephant? He's taken forever to come on. Well, he's somewhere. I can see it right here, so I don't know what the deal is why he's not popping up. Okay. Let me try this again. For some reason, my elephant is not showing up on the screen. I'm confused where my elephant is. That's really strange. Okay, so my elephant doesn't want to work right now. So I'm going to use this other elephant. I'm going to go to insert images. Where are my... I am totally confused right now, guys. Because my elephants are not showing up for some reason. That is really strange. There they are. 
my thing was just look at that it's like printing all these things i don't know what the deal was that was totally strange so i'm going to right click on my elephant i'm either going to expand it this way or i'm going to go over to edit and here's the size you can change the position of it you can rotate it so i'm just going to put it up here and i'm going to make it the size i want and i'm going to click go and here's my elephant right here on the screen i can put that anywhere so then i would go i would go down here and i would click go again okay so of course my my laptop is not connected to my cricut right now uh, but i would print go to print page and so then cricut is going to send that file to my epson printer that's on wi-fi i would click print again right here then after you click print it's going to come from your computer it's going to print on your computer you're going to take your your uh printed elephant the sheet you're going to put it on your cricut mat and your cricut machine is going to scan these lines right here because it wants to get the perfect cut once it scans these lines then it's going to cut this elephant out. It's going to leave all the white around it and cut the elephant out. So guys, that is how you find an image from Google and then save it to your computer, open it up in your design space, print it from your printer, and cut it with your design space with your Cricut machine. Guys, I hope I was very helpful on this video. If you have any other questions, comments, suggestions, leave them down below in the uh, comment section. If you wouldn't mind, please subscribe to my channel. Click like, comment, share this video. It's really helpful. Um, I hope y'all guys have a blessed May. And like I said, if you have any questions, just leave them down below. Bye-bye now.